These injuries are affecting a significant portion of our population. In fact, as of 1 September, 66% of our most seriously wounded soldiers were suffering from post-traumatic stress or traumatic brain injury. About three years ago, when we started seeing the suicide issue growing like it did in Vietnam, we started talking about what we could possibly do with uh, horses. So the, the way this program will work is veterans will come into the program. They will, uh, usually about six at a time, we'll put them through a three-day introduction to horses. It deals with horse safety, horse psychology, and the connection process that we teach which seems to make a tremendous difference in their lives. There it is. <laughs> Got a new buddy? Yeah. Can I take him home? <laughs> so you talked to this horse? I think so. <laughs> the horse talked to you? Yeah. Tell me that. The horse talked to me. What's he saying now? No, he's happy. <laughs> and so am I though, that was, that was really incredible. And what's really unique is we have world-class horses assisting world-class soldiers. <laughs>